So hey, we're here. I'm Mark Graves with Courtyard Realty, where my go job is to be your guide. We're over here at Kinder's. It's packed. It always is. It's one of the best barbecue houses you can get on this side of the tunnel. And so we're going to be speaking with the manager in just a minute just to say thank you and appreciate it. You see those stuffed baked potatoes? You take that home to one of your children and you'll just make a friend out of them in no time. All of their real raw meats, marinated meats, you can pick up here. All of their foods that are hot, made right here, burgers, blazing ball tip sandwiches, sweet potato fries, regular fries, chili, you name it, they have it here and it's just all super fantastic. I've been coming to this place for 35 years. It wasn't always in just in this location, it was always all the way over in uh, Pacheco. But now we're here as well and it is just fabulous to have this in our community. They do a lot of charitable work down through the hospitals and whatnot for the virus and the shelter in place. You can see by all the pictures that everybody that's anybody's ever been here, and even guys that are not somebody like me. Uh, <laughs> this is Mark Graves with uh, Courtyard Realty, where my job is to be your guide. We're over here at Kinder's Meat Market with the Ignacio Valley community. We are so fortunate to have them here. They just, the, the quality of their food is unsurpassed, untouchable by anybody. The quality of their meat, their eggs, their prepared food, the service is beyond reproach. It is fantastic. We're blessed to be able to have a number of different kinders throughout our little Bay Area here. Um, there are other barbecue houses, there are other meat markets, but I don't think anything touches the quality and for me the flavor here. The service is impeccable. I can't say enough about this place. If you've never been here or if you've been here, you need to come back or try this. And then if you love it, give me all the credit. Uh, <laughs> so enough about me. This is Corey. She's a manager here. She helps this place run seamlessly. You can do take out. Anyway, I'll let her say a little something. So, Corey, how's this uh, pandemic, uh, COVID-19, been affecting your business? Uh, the, the, the town has come together and they come in here and they've supported us a lot. Um, it's, staying, it's staying busy. Like, the, the raw meats have been selling a lot. The food is still popular. We haven't had any trouble with that. It's staying busy. Yeah, you know, some, some restaurants, some takeout places were not geared for takeout, but this place has had a huge takeout presence for a long, long time. So I can only imagine that it got more so. We were ready for it. For sure. Yeah, absolutely. So you were ready for it, for <laughs> real. Yeah, that's excellent. And um, so here's all their salads, and I think I already, I'll probably repeat myself, but the pastas, the baked potatoes, they have all kinds of things and I know I don't know how to do it but I know sometimes people come here and order special things that that they know how to do so talk to the talk to the staff here and ask them what do other people do what's something secret that I can you know be the hit of my neighborhood with on a barbecue but their marinated ball tips over there their skewers their meats on the stick and again I said it already once but just the simplicity of their eggs I never knew that you could have such a variance in flavor for just raw egg to cook. You take them home and all of a sudden your breakfast is tremendous. So I've been coming to Kinder's Meats since I think there was only two locations. I don't want to tell you how long ago that was because I'm only 29, but it, yeah, right? <laughs> yeah, we're almost the same age. She's a little older than I am. Uh, <laughs> it's my story, I can tell it how I want. But um, all these people have been here and they all love it. Oh, look, there's Stephen Curry. Um, so just a fantastic place. Uh, Ignacio Valley community, this is a huge asset and I'm really, really glad that they let me say a little something in appreciation for all the help that they give our community. So thank you very much. 